What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Double A Nice Skills, and welcome back to the Bayfica Career Mode, baby. Welcome back to 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 to, to awesomeness. Today's about to be absolutely lit. I got some comments right here on my phone of moves you guys want me to make, and I've got to make them happen ASAP. So that's exactly what's gonna happen today. Before we go any further, bros, if you are enjoying this SLB Career Mode, that that sports leads more of Bayfica. That's that, that abbreviation SLB. If you're enjoying um uh, this this uh, Career Mode, please smash that big old thumbs up. Y'all got nine. 1,000 likes and yesterday you got over 5,000 likes so can we hit 5,000 likes again today is a comment that comes in and I'm gonna read it out now on the phone oh here we go actually it's 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 the cashless gamer all right the cashless gamer says I've been writing I've been writing a sign Barco is that how you say it in all of your videos some sometimes it gets so many likes and you haven't seen it dude I'm really sorry that I haven't seen it and the videos get a lot of comments bro and I'm really sorry that I haven't seen it yet but I was looking at Barco I hopefully I'm saying that right and there's two of them. There's Mario, which is a striker, and there's an 18-year-old. And I'm not exactly sure which one you actually want me to sign. Um, I feel like you want me to go after the, the striker version. I don't know which one it is. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm, I, I, I'm, I, I, it might be the winger that you want. I, I'm actually not 100% sure who you want me to bring in, but I will check them out. Hopefully I got the right one. A lot of people told me to go ahead and bring in Musa. That means we're going to lose Andre Almeida, uh, which I like Andre. It's funny. I hated Andre Almeida in real life, but now I actually really like him. He actually, you know, he's that player that he's not a flashy player. He's not a great player, but he gets the job done. Y'all told me to definitely bring in Thomas. And you told me to look at Petr Cech. And I was like really surprised by this move. But someone told me that if I offer 4 million for Petr Cech, that we can actually get the 35-year-old guy in here. And I'm like, wait, is that really a thing? So what I'm going to do is actually sit down and offer him 4 million. I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna offer him four million. I'm gonna sit down and offer Petr Cech four million to Arsenal and see what they say. And as you can see, that's not a thing. So in the comments, they told me to try to offer four million, but it did not happen. So I guess they don't really know what to negotiate with Musa. So what I'm gonna do is sit down and speak to Musa and see if I can make this work because Musa's the type of player that he could play striker or left mid, and that's pretty awesome, man. Um, I want to give him, he's very young, I want to give him a five-year deal, baby. You go with the five-year deal, I'm cool with a five-year deal. No release clause, and your wage is 89. Um, can we counter this a little bit? What Will you take, hey, will you take your wages? I know this sounds weird, but will you take your wages at 79, bro? Come on, man. 76. I'm going to say yes. And you're probably like, why? 76 actually helps me a lot because wages are going to be a big issue here at Benfica because we can't pay players a lot of money. So with that being said, we're going to lose on today Almeida, but I'm in the market for a right back either way. And look at the smile on my man Musa's face, bro. He was extremely happy. Musa, welcome to the squad, baby. I hope, I hope, I hope this works out great. The next one is Conte. Now, Conti is actually signed for Benfica in real life already. It's happened. It's a done deal. Um, the thing is, I don't really know how much to pay a 23-year-old that's coming from the Argentinian league, bro. You're going to be like a, a critical player here. I'm not lying to you, bro. You're going to be very important to the team, brother. Um, he wants a five-year deal, and I'm simply okay with it. I'm not going to lie to you. I don't really want a release clause on you. Can you? Ah. Oh. What do I pay him? You think he'll take like 50? And like a 500 sign on? Is that good? Is that too much? I'm gonna try 40 and five. Don't go running out, bro. Don't go running out. Don't go, please don't go running out. Please don't go running out. That's a fair offer. My client's happy with that. Did I overpay? I don't really know how, what you offer players. I feel like 40,000 is not a lot. I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like 40000 is not a lot. Um, but there you go, man. We just brought in two awesome signings. Now, um, this guy actually signed with Benfica in real life. And I want to show you his stats. His sprint speed is 74. More importantly, bros, he's 6'4 at the center back position with 74 pace at the age of 23. Like, that's a great signing from Befica in real life. I love Servi. Servi's a great player, man. I'm not going to lie to you. Young 23-year-old with some good sprint speed on him. He got some 88 sprint speed. But now we got Musa as well. So this is going to be interesting to see how we play this out. I actually might play a little bit different. I might I might just have to go to the traditional 4-1-2-1-2 wide. Um, 
I might have to go to the 4 one 2 one 2 wide Bench some players. Start some players. Renato Sanchez is a super sub, so we're not really tripping on him playing or, whatever, or, or he's on loan. So we're not really tripping on him starting or not starting. I'm not really tripping on that. And at the cam position, I mean, our team's looking pretty... I'll figure out the thing. Right now, the problem is, is we don't got a right back. Right now, we got a 19-year-old, 69 overall at the right back position. We have to fix that ASAP. So this is interesting, right? Because uh, my man Juan, was it Juan in the comments down below? He said, sign Musa and get Pavan. And Pavan is actually playing. He, he looked pretty impressive for Argentina. And what's funny is today, as I was reading the Benfica news, Salvio actually on Instagram, Salvio, you are right mid that we sold in this career mode. He told Pavan to sign with Benfica, like to join, to join Benfica. Um, so that's a thing and you want me to bring him in so you know what man his release clause is 19 million I'm gonna wait to see if I get a little bit of money in and if we do then we'll make it happen in the comments down below uh, Cash is gamer. Can you please let me know what Barco you actually wanted me to bring in bro? Was it the striker or the left mid Giovanni dos Santos accepts, but you guys told me not to bring him in this one is interesting we want anywhere from 31 million to 45 and Napoli. excuse me roma offered 45 excuse me 30 i want 45 that that's the most we can get for him i'm gonna tell them to give me 45 and just see what they say i wouldn't mind selling pz because um i got cams now i'm gonna play more of a cam formation they say 35 i'm gonna come back and say 40 Come on, bro. Work with me. Give me 40, baby. Give me 40. Give me 40. 37. Damn, that's close, man. That's close to what I'm asking. That's really close, man. Let's say 39. That's really close, man. Maybe I should have taken that. Uh, we don't want to... Yo, let's go! BZ for 39 million. I like BZ a lot at Benfica. I really, really do. But... There was even talks after the season ended that Samaris, Raul Jimenez, and PZ, and possibly Salvio would be out of Benfica. They've been at Benfica, for, especially Salvio. He's been there a long time. PZ, not so much, but he, he's been at the point where he's had a couple good seasons that we thought big teams were going to snatch him up regardless. So I don't want to sell my entire team, and that's not what I'm doing. I'm, not, I'm keeping like a lot of us. It's just I think it's time to move on. Now that we have brought Talishka back, we got Renato Sanchez. Uh, we got Felipe. Um, we got uh, Kokonovic. Kro 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 I suck with his name, man. I legitimately suck with this man's name. All right, so talks actually broke down with Samaris leaving. And that's a big issue, isn't it? Because Samaris is somebody I really want to leave. And I was counting on that money to be able to bring in Thomas at the center back position. So I'm a little bit uh, frustrated with that. I'm not going to lie with, to you. Andre Arthur now sold for 12 million. I don't want to sell the youngster, bro. I don't want to. Now nah, we're rejecting that. We're, I'm not selling the youngster. Enter. I'm sorry, bro, but not right now. And the, the thing about Thomas is I don't know if I have enough money right now, bros. It looks like I have enough. It looks like I have enough. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. Bang, baby. Three new signings one day. Conti and Thomas in the back. I like that. I obviously need myself a nice little right back. I think the deal for PZ is probably going to break down. Let me tell you something. Samaris is my, I mean, Faja is, Faja is my favorite player at Fika. I love him. Um, so he's probably going to be our CDM. We'll figure out our formation, but I need a right back. So unfortunately, we did lose PZ. It's a tough one, man, because I really like him at Fika. But I knew that if I wanted to make any moves, I would have to sell him. I mean, he was one of our big name players that would make us money. So... BZ's going to be out of the club. Um, I'm going to tell you right now who's staying for sure. I really like Carilu and he's not going nowhere. Um, I feel like Carilu should be playing at Befica, but for some reason, our manager just keep putting the man on loan. So Carilu's going to kind of take a step in the right direction on this team, I think. I like Carilu. He's having a good World Cup as well. Rafa has a lot of speed as well. I like that about him. Uh, Musa and Jonas up top is pretty damn nasty, if you ask me. I'm not settled on Taliska yet. I don't know if Talisha's going to stay or not. I really can't tell you how that's going to play out. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. Mitroglu 100% is leaving because he left in real life. And Raul Jimenez was someone I was going to let go of as well. But it doesn't really seem like a lot of people want to buy him. I'm going to try to make a move for Butlin. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this happen. But I really would like to bring the Stoke City man in. But I would like to bring him in by using someone like Raul Jimenez. So I'm going to offer Raul Jimenez for Butlin and see what they say. They say they're looking for a right back. And that's just something I don't got, bro. I don't got a right back. Um, but what I do got is 14 million, 13 million. Oh, they're running out the door. They're going to do the whole this and 
I told you. I told you. I told you, man. Damn it, yo. That feels bad, man. So I know there's a lot of y'all that are just like me. Ajax have so many young, promising players. Um, so many players with so much talent. Wow, Sanchez is here? Wait, why is Sanchez here? Isn't that the Spurs, man? Wait, I'm confused. Is he not on Spurs yet? Is he not at Spurs yet? Is that, is that... Is he not there yet? Did that not, like, is that not the new deal going, wait a minute. What about if we stole Sanchez? We don't really need another center back, though, at this point. I need a goalkeeper. Are their goalkeepers nice? How good are their goalkeepers? Hey, I'm going to try to sneak in there for the keeper. I'm going to try, I'm going to try to finesse my way into this bad boy. Let's see, man. What you want, baby? What we talking? What you looking like? How we feeling, brother? How we feeling, brother? Tell me. Hey, you want a striker? You want a striker? What are you saying? You want a striker? You want a striker? You want a striker? Y'all want a striker? Y'all interested in a striker? We're interested in a center back. Okay. Okay. You're interested in a center back? I got center backs. Not Thomas. Not Conte. Not Lisandro Lopez. Not Jardel. You want Luis though? <laughs> He's old as hell. Um, would you offer Jardel here? Would you offer Lisandro Lopez? Lisandro Lopez is possibly leaving in real life as well. He's been on loan at Inter. I think he's back now, but we're talking about letting him go again. Would you take Lisandro Lopez? Would they take Lisandro? I don't really want to get rid of... Would you get rid of Jardel at the age of 31 or Lisandro Lopez at the age of 27? I'm thinking Jardel, but Jardel's the GOAT at Fica. I love Jardel and Luis Zong. They're so old, but they're loyal. They're warriors. Yo, they've been there forever. They're warriors, man. They're part of this badge, man. They've done so well for us, yo. Even though they suck, they just, they fight, you know? They're, they're just, ha. Ah. He's old, though. He is old. He's old. I'm gonna get that. He's old. He's, ah, let's try it, man. YOLO, man. He is old, man. And 11 million. Would you take Jardel and seven? And 10? Okay. Hey. I give you, I give you 15%. If you drop this to six, 15%. Jardel and six. Let's go! Let's go! Jardel, though. Hey, this keeper's all right, right? Y'all told me. Some people in the comments said he was all right. Some people in the comments said he was all right. I'm counting on y'all, baby. I'm counting on y'all, baby. I'm counting on y'all to get this one right, bros. I'm counting on y'all right now. I am counting on you guys to get this right right here, man. Um, all right, here we go. You're, you're important, baby. You're pretty much our number one. I want you. You're our number one keeper, bro. Uh, you're our number one, okay? What's up now? I want a five-year deal. You're hella young. 21 years old, I'm down. I'm all about that life, yo. No release clause. We're not about that. We don't need that. Right here is where it gets interesting. Would you take... Is that too low, bros? Don't run out, dude. Don't run out, dude. Is he good? Is he good? Is he good? Is he good? Let's go! He's good. He's good. He's good. He's good. I'm not good with wages, bros. But check this out. 78 overall, 21-year-old, bro. Let's go. These are the keeper. These are the players I'm willing to trade. Not Louis Zong. He's too much of a legend. Our keeper, he's leaving in real life. It looks like Raul Jimenez, LSA was probably leaving as well. Julius Cesar, he already left on a free lift for free. We let him go and we bought him, but it looks like we're kind of willing to let him go already. Also, some of these I'm cool with letting go of, but all these other guys, all these young guys and stuff, I'm cool with keeping them around. This guy was for Arsenal, you guys know. Um, so like these guys are kind of the reason I'm cool with them because they're, they're kind of gone at Benfica the way they kind of passed it, man. So I like this team we're putting together, yo. We're keeping the Benfica's young players and we're building around them. And also Mitra Glue. I'm cool to let Mitra Glue go because he actually left in real life as well. So, bros, in the comments down below, let me know, man. It, who can I trade Mitra Glue on if I can't sell them? Who can I trade Julius Cesar on? I got to find a right back ASAP. All right, bros. I don't really want to get too far ahead because I want to know what you guys want me to do with these guys. But as you can see, I have three Barcelona players here. I'm going to try to get Nelson back off loan. It's not going to happen. So that's an L right there. Okay, so Nelson's got to go. Um, Vidal. They're not willing to loan him. His release clause is $12 million. 
and my big thing right now actually is Vidal, Vidal is a 76 overall with 91 pace at the age of 27. He could play right back or right mid. What are we saying to that? A 76 overall, that's ultimate team. A 76 overall, what are we saying to that, bro? Are we saying that's a tough one. Um, also, look at this. He's at Barca right now. They're not willing to loan him, but are you willing, willing to sell him? Are you willing to trade him with Mitral Glue? That's the crazy, that's the, that's the question right now. Are you willing to pick up another striker? Do you want a striker? Do you want Mitro Glue? Because I ain't doing nothing with him. And if you know what I'm saying, if you maybe want something, you want a right back, I ain't got one. I don't have a right back, bro. Why does every team keep a look? You want him? You want Pedro? You want my man Pedro? You want my man Pedro? Huh? That's what I'm saying. You don't want him. You don't want him. If you don't want him, what am I supposed to do? Um, would you take 25? Would you take 25? 38? 26. What are you saying? 31? I'm leaving. Damn it, yo. That's a solid player as well. That's a pretty solid player. I'm going to sit down with Vidal. Now, the thing about him, right, is that he doesn't start. And he's only a 76 overall at the age of 27. That's that's kind of a low overall for such a... If I can get him on the cheap for like 5 million, I'm down. If I can get him for like 5 million, I'm down. I'm off of four. four is a bit low. I'm off of five. That's that's low, I know, bros, but they say 10. Um, I say seven. I don't even know if that's nine. He's 27. He's 27, bro. I'm down with seven, bro. We're gonna take some time to think about it. At the age of 27, would you pay more? I don't I don't think I should pay more. There was a guy here named Gomez. Y'all know who I'm talking about? The youngster that somebody told me to sign. And and I can't find him here. I legit can't find him anywhere. So I think he might have went on loan or they sold him, but I, something really stood out to me, bros. Something really stood out to me. I saw Mario Gaspas is now. A Gaspar is, is, is now a part of Manchester United. And I said, damn, that's 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 interesting, right? Because they have Valencia at 32. And then I decided, you know what, let me let me approach him. And it says, approached by Barcelona. And I say, he's old, but it's Valencia. And Valencia's pretty damn nasty. And I got some more players up my sleeve. Don't don't you forget. Felipe Luis. And we got not. I didn't want Felipe Luis. My fault. Take Felipe Luis out. I got a center back from uh, uh, from, uh, from from AC Milan. I also got a right back from AC Milan, and they have another right back as well that I can speak to at AC Milan because they have two good right backs. And AC Milan, Atletico Madrid. My fault. At Atletico Madrid. So first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and pull up on Antonio Valencia from Manchester United. I'm gonna pull up, baby, you know, cause they, they got a new right back. They don't need this right back. Um, he's 32. You know, old players, you can get cheaper. They value him at 16. Um, so I'm gonna offer it 10. I'm gonna offer it 10. What are you saying? They want 16. Hold on, Mourinho, Mourinho. Mourinho, so Portuguese on. So Portuguese on. So Portuguese on. Come on now. I'm Portuguese, baby. I'm Portuguese, huh? I'm Portuguese. Give me a deal, bro. Cut me that deal. Cut me that Portuguese deal. Yo, we root, we root for the same team in the World Cup. <sighs> Mourinho. Thank God, my man. Mourinho. Hey, listen, buddy. Mourinho. Listen, buddy. 15. 15. A little bit on tax. I save money. You save money. Ha do I do it? Do I pay 15? Do I pay 15? Do I pay 15, bros? Dude, what if I can get Valencia though? Another youngster here, baby. Another youngster from Atletico Madrid. I don't even want to loan this. I want to try to sneak in and steal him. I want to try to steal this guy right from under their eyes. He had a good season in real life, didn't he? I want to try to steal him, man. Let's see, man. Um, will you take Raul? I don't really want to give Raul Jimenez at this point. Um, what are you saying? What are you saying? You don't want a striker? You want a right back? Of course you want a right back. Everybody wants a right back, bro. Everybody wants a right back. Listen. 
10 million, I'll give you a release of 20. Let's lower this a little more to seven. Huh? What are you saying? What are you saying? 15? Simeone, listen, hey, 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 I just, I just talked to Mourinho, huh? I'm doing a deal with Mourinho, huh? I'm doing a deal with Mourinho, I'm good at this stuff, let me, let me, it's gonna happen. You don't want to release Klaus now? 13 million. 13 million? He says 15. Damn, man. Um, at this point, I think I just take it. That's a better offer. Damn. Bros, hold on, bros. Yo, this kid has mad potential. 21 years young, bro. This kid has mad potential, bro. Mad potential, bro. Mad, 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 mad potential, bro. Mad potential. I know I gave a youngster away, but the youngster was only valued at three million. Probably shouldn't have done that, but that could be a starting center back right there, bro. That could be a starting center back right there, bro. Mmm. Mmm. Yo, this career mode, this career mode is nuts. This career mode is actually the craziest career mode I've ever done. Legit, man. This career mode is absolutely nuts, bro. You're an important player, bro. You don't even know, bro. You don't even know, bro. Like, listen, you, 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 like, yo, five-year deal at 21, bro. Give this man a five-year deal, bro. Listen, brother, what else do you want, bro? I'm, I'm cool with no release clause. How much money do you want? You tell me. You tell me. Please tell me. Please tell me. Please tell me. You, you get it. No. I don't know what to give him, man. 50. It's going to be too low. 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 That's a really good center back, bros. That's a really good center back, bros. That's a really good center back, bros. That's a really good set. Let's get it. That's a good. I have to, bro. I had to. That's too good of a center back, bro, for 15 million. That's too good of a center back for 15 million, bro. That's way too good of a center back for 15 million. Way too good of a center back for 15 million, bro. He's only a 76 overall. Doesn't matter. He's going to grow so much, yo. Look at that, man. What's his sprint speed? Sprint speed 64. Did I make a bad move? You all think I made a bad move? I don't think I made a bad move. I think I made a great move. I know this guy in real life. This guy, this guy has great potential. All right, bros. I'm pretty happy with my center backs now. I'm actually perfect with my center backs. I got my man Thomas, Conti. I got Lopez and Hernandez. I'm happy as hell with that. Luis Zong, obviously old. He's going to stay, but he's not really going to get much playing time. I'll be 100% honest with you. We're done on defense. We got backup center backs and starting center backs, but we need a right back, and we need a right back ASAP. It could be Valencia. Or should I get somebody young? Y'all blow it up in the comments down below. Our team is starting to come together. It's starting to gel as one. We have 35 million still. Uh, we still have loads of players that are going to be exiting, man. A lot of players that can go. Samariz, uh, Mitro Glu, you know, uh, Julio Cesar, Raul Jimenez. I don't even know if Raul Jimenez is actually going to leave, man. I'm thinking Raul Jimenez stays now, man. I think we keep Raul, man. We let Raul Jimenez stay because... I mean, look at Raul Jimenez behind Jonas and Musa. I'm going to get one more striker, 100% sure about that. I got Carilu to play right mid for Felipe Luis. We got um, uh, we got Zigovic uh, to take to take Servi's spot when Servi's tired. Talishka plays Cam. And then we have another Cam right here. Renato Sanchez is also in the thing to go behind Faija with Gucci. Left back, we don't... Well, we do have a substitution at left back. It's a Liceu right now. I don't have a right back. So we need a right back... And then we just got to beef up the team. Another striker, maybe a different cam, some more speed in the midfield. Probably going to change the formation up into a 4-4-2, to be honest with you. I think I'm feeling the 4-4-2 flat. I'm not going to lie to you guys, bros. I think I'm feeling the 4-4-2 flat, rocking out with something like this and maybe even bringing in my man Renato Sanchez like that. Um, Renato Sanchez is not really a star. He's not like a, you know, he's not a, he doesn't belong to us. I don't really care to play him or not. We'll figure that out. But, bros, it's slowly but surely really starting to come together. Look at that young, deep backline I have. I know they're not the highest overalls, but their young talent 
that are only going to grow super fast and become super, super, super good. Another 21-year-old, 23 right there, 21 right there, 26 right there. Servi, hella young as well. My man Servi, 23. Musa, 24. Jonas, 33. That boy old. My man, 21. Look at that. Yo, look at this team, bro. It's a young, beautiful, sexy team. And we are going to cause so much damage in this league. I'm trying to tell y'all right now. They don't even know what's coming, man. The speed we have, the squad we have is starting to come together. Please, in the comments down below, let me know what barcode you guys wanted me to sign. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. What right back do I get? Do I get Valencia? Do I try to get for a younger one? And we need a striker. We need some more CMs. We're good on the winger position, but we need some more center midfielders. And we need another. Uh, uh, we need a right back. Blow it up in the comments down below. I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. Let's get it. Whoa, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Double Eight Nine Skills, and welcome back to the Befica Career Mode. I got my phone on deck. I got the comments down below. I know exactly the moves you guys want me to make in this Befica Super League Career Mode. If you don't know what's going on, we have moved Befica to the EPL, but we have added most of the big teams around Europe, and we are doing the Super League with my favorite team, which is Befica. Now, with that being said, bros, this, 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 this Career Mode is going to be one the hardest career modes we have ever dealt with transfer window wise to bring players in it's going to be very difficult with all that being said yesterday's episode got 9,000 likes i told you guys to smash a thumbs up if you wanted this to be a thing you guys smash that thumbs up like it was no one's business i'm gonna do episode two and see how you guys are feeling